I was actually excited that the wind farms were coming in. They'd always intrigued me. The construction workers from the wind farm are a blessing to our community, not only to our store, because those kind of people are hard to come by anymore. I'm Lauren Lance. And I'm Regina Lance, and together we own the Mildred store in Mildred, Kansas. The store is essential to our community. And we are told about that quite frequently. People come in and say, we're, th we're really glad you're here. The store is over 100 years old, and it's only one of two structures that are from the original town of Mildred. Since the wind farm construction began, our daily totals have at least doubled. The extra income has really been a blessing. My name is Kirk Dwyer. I own and operate Chanty's Grill and Shake here in Marion, Kansas. Been here since 1992. The wind farm uh, coming into our area has been unbelievable. Business overall, at least in my, my business, has probably increased I would say roughly at least 30%. And gosh, Lee, the boost to, to business has been incredible. My name's Stevie Kennard. I am the lead project developer for the Prairie Queen Wind Farm. When construction starts for a wind farm, we have up to two to 300 people that come into town to help build this project over the six to nine month process that it takes to build a wind farm. And so local businesses really see an influx of funds from the construction of a wind farm during that period. I would say economically, the wind farm, since they've been here, has done great things for the communities. The wind farms coming into our community is a big plus because it's gonna create some jobs. That generate, once you generate more money, the county gets more tax money. So it's a, it's a snowball effect and it's a win-win for everybody here. According to a recent news article from a local paper, sales tax revenues are actually up 22% this year compared to years prior. When EDPR comes to an area, it's more than just a business transaction. We know that we're going to be here for the foreseeable future. These turbines are going to be seen across this landscape for the next you know, 40 to 50 years. And so not only do we want to support the landowners who we're you know, leasing the property from, but we want to be able to support the community because they are a part of this project as well. It's nothing for us to have a whole table of people sitting there eating. And when one of the wind farm guys gets up and leaves, he says, I wanna pay for the whole table. They're, com they're putting money into our community. They're putting money into everything in Allen County that they touch, that they do. I have seen nothing but a positive impact on Allen County. You know, they're supporting more than just us and other businesses, they're supporting our community. Nobody likes change, but you'll see down the road, the clean energy, to me, it's a positive thing. Once the change is there and they get used to it, it'll all be fine. With the windmill farm coming in, if it's coming in anywhere around your area or close to your area, absolutely get excited about it. It's a neat project. You're going to meet people that are, that are very good people. It's been a positive thing all the way around. <laughs>